we don't like ourselves, if we don't love ourselves, we are going to, through the law of attraction, gravitate towards people who are gonna reflect that back to us. Before we heal, we have a tendency to internalize everything that is happening to us. And what I mean by that is when someone does something to us, we take it as a reflection of our own worth, our own value. And one thing that I've learned on this spiritual path and actually I learned this a long time ago through Don Miguel Ruiz's book, The Four Agreements, and he talks about this idea of don't take anything personally. But of course, you know, as we live life, we forget these things and, you know, we fall off track, but it is very, very, very true. Never take anything personally. You know, when someone does something to you that you think is maybe a betrayal, when someone does something to you that you feel is wrong, if someone hurts you in some way, understand that that is a reflection of what is going on inside of that person. It is not a reflection of you. And this is how we release the, the shame that a lot of us accumulate over time through these experiences because we're going around and we're internalizing everything that's happening to us, not realizing that every single person in this world is just projecting their own hurt and their own pain onto other people. And I think that this pattern starts out early in childhood right? Because as children, we don't know who we are. We only know who we are based on the reflection that we're getting from our parents. And so if we grow up in, let's say, traumatic childhood environments, and I mean, it can be major trauma to minor trauma. However, it still impacts you regardless of, you know, the, the degree of trauma. So as children, we don't know who we are. So we see and we decide who we are through the reflection. And we carry on this pattern of trying to figure out who we are through how people treat us or how people um, you know, interact with us. And this is so false and this paradigm and this way of interacting with the world will always mess you up. And it's going to dramatically impact how you see yourself if you keep connecting to and engaging with people who are treating you poorly. And that's what many of us do. If we don't like ourselves, if we don't love ourselves, we are going to, through the law of attraction, gravitate towards people who are gonna reflect that back to us. And if we don't understand how this universe works, we are going to internalize that. And what happens is that deep-rooted shame becomes stronger and stronger and stronger. So the way that we begin to release this is to understand that nothing in this universe is personal. When we heal, we stop internalizing these experiences. So this is one of the most powerful ways to begin loving yourself to begin healing yourself, and most importantly, to begin connecting back to your inner divinity, which means that union of self. You know, that's when we are most settled in who we are. That's when things in the universe start working out for us. That's when we start experiencing miracles. We have normalized being disconnected from self, and in this society, there's so many ways that we disconnect from self. And so when we begin practicing the art of not taking anything personally, I do recommend The Four Agreements by Don Miguel Ruiz, but when we stop taking things personally, bit by bit, we can peel the layers of trauma, of shame, of anger, of resentment, of all of these things that often weren't ours to begin with, right? We take that on often at such an early age and because we're never taught how to let it go, we carry it into adulthood. So as I mentioned, this is a core part of really doing the work. If this video interests you today, I do have a course that really dives deep into all of this work about connecting back to the self, and it's called Journey Back to Self. So it's a written course, it has a bonus video, it has a bonus inner child healing meditation, there's a self-love workshop, there's journal prompts, worksheets, tons of information to help you learn how to build a better relationship to self. So if that interests you, it is 50% off. I'll leave it in the comment section. But as always, I'm here to work with you one-on-one. -on -one. I do have a three week and a six week coaching program if you're interested, but I wanna thank you guys so much for tuning in and I'll see you soon. Take care.